Today, we're opening an entire case of 2022 Mega Tins. What's up, guys? We're back with another video, and today we are battling Rhyme Style in a case battle of the 2022 Mega Tens. We're going to be searching for the Dark Magician Girl, the Blue Eyes especially, and of course, Pot of Prosperity and other amazing cards like that. That's not the only exciting thing happening in this video today because we're opening a case, but also you guys can win two cases of the new 2022 Mega Tens. Sassy Auto is sponsoring a giveaway. He's giving away two separate cases, so two different winners. You guys will get a sealed case of the 2022 Mega Tens. All you have to do to enter that giveaway is like this video, be subscribed, turn on notifications, follow Sassy Auto on Instagram, and make sure to let me know in the comments what your favorite card or most excited card you are for this. Most excited card? I don't know if that works, but you know the card you're most excited for from these tens. So we have a huge opening and a huge giveaway today. Let's go ahead and get into it because we have 12 of these tens. I'm going to go ahead and crack open all these tens we're gonna get all the mega packs out and then we're gonna do the mega pack opening because it's 36 packs which is you know a decent amount and also opening these 10 individually takes forever so we're gonna skip through that All right, we are back. We've opened up all the packs. So here they are, 36 packs of Mega Pack 2022. Let's start it off. So we have not pulled a lot of the good cards yet. We did an opening the other day. If you guys missed that one, go check it out. Um, we opened up some, uh, I think it was like half a case. So we have twice as many packs in this video. We pulled some good stuff like Ash and Ghost Bell, but we not pulled Prosperity. We didn't pull any of the new reprints, which is what we kind of want to pull. Link Apple in the chat. Let's go AK in the comments because we are not live right now. But if we were, you know, Link Apple in the chat. Um, we will be doing a live stream later today, but uh, you guys are going to see this a lot later. There's a Dark Ruler No More. That's a really good card. One of the better ones. We got a Breaking Ruin God Ultra. And then, oh, a Cross Out Designator. One we did not pull last time. This is a nice one. It was printed first in the 2021 10s. Now it's getting the upgrade in rarity and the 2022 tens. That's a really nice one. A good start. I don't know the value of this thing, but I guess it is probably one of the better cards. The thing with the Mega Tens, though, is there's not a ton of cards that are worth like over 10 bucks because they're very easy to pull. Like even when they talk about like worse ratios they're still pretty easy to pull and then everyone's buying them because it's the most popular set of the year so values is only on the very top card so we'll kind of see what the values are sitting at when we get through this and when it's edited out and everything scary c we got the masquerade the blazing dragon it's a super we rock some special by the way you might have missed that uh, i didn't even bring it back the revived sky god dark on oh dark on it's got an ultra reprint okay we didn't see that last time this used to be a secret in the original pack Ooh, and a ruddy rose. This is a good one, too, because this was like a $25 card, I think, out of uh, whatever the set with the black rose is. But which one was it? Blazing Vortex or something like that? That's a good secret rare. We will take that for sure. Also, we have only beaten Rhyme Style, I think, maybe once. I really can't even remember if we've beaten him. I feel like we beat him in like one where we both did really, really bad. So it didn't really feel like a win, but he's beaten us in almost every battle ever. So make sure you guys go check out his video after this so you can let him know and let me know who won the battle between me and him. So you can see an entire case from both both of us is gonna be pretty cool these cards are sliding everywhere like they're so slippery and it's very annoying trying to stack these up i can't like yeah this is falling apart this is not good it's still sliding come on chill out we got the frost that's a pretty good card we get the Machina Uncle Spear. Uncle Spear. I don't know how to say that. Soul Energy Max. Okay. And then the ZS Ascended Sage. Not a bad card there. And then the Fabled Andorath. I'll be interested to see, like, because when I was editing the first video, because I actually edited the first video because it was the same day. Um, yeah, the values were, they weren't even that high. And I was like, man, these are like before it gets released. These are going to be pretty low. Hidden Springs. We got the Meowth Click. Cordius. This is usually one of the best sets to, like, if you actually buy a case, then you can actually, you know, not necessarily make money, but just get a lot of value if you want a lot of these cards. But then eventually the prices go really low because everybody bought it. The Dark Honest, the Machina Uncle Sparse. Incredible Ecclesia. Ooh, I might have to replace this with my uh, regular secrets. Very nice. That's beautiful. And by the way, if you guys haven't bought any yet, Sassy Auto still has, I think he still has the link up. Should be Ruxin special for $10 off your case if you guys want to buy some as well. Lots of sold. So, you know, it's a very popular set. That's what every year the Mega Tens, I think, sell the most out of any Yu-Gi-Oh products. So very quality one to buy. Ice Shade Act, you got the Stairway, Rocket Caliber, Stellar Wind Wolf. We got a Ruxin Special. I've Ruxin Special that rare every time, man. Radiant, Solar Energy Max. We got the uh, Elvane, All Vane, the Essence of Vanity, and the Rocks Rose Dragon. All right, very cool. All right, that's only like, we're only a couple tins in, I would say. So, not even that. We're four packs in. We've got 
we're about like what is that a ninth of the way through or something like that we got 36 packs i think that's right yep we've got the uh thunder the flip frozen magic key unlocking this shouldn't even be that long of a video to be honest i think it'll be maybe we might be in the 20 minute range heritage of light abyss keeper which recently we've been doing that a lot rocks rose back to back that's kind of weird i think that was out of the same tin technically yeah because i didn't mix these up at all so this would have been the same tin you get to the same prismatic secret that would be a bummer yeah if you buy one tin you get to the same card and there it's not really a great one okay master diploma yeah but we've been doing a lot more like 15 to 20 minute videos and it seems like a lot of you guys have appreciated it based on the comments that i've seen you guys are like oh i really like these uh, longer videos there's a Rabina, if you like the Flanderese, which if you do, a lot of people hate you. I, I no judgment, no judgment over here. I'm just saying, mimicking man eater bug. We got the dark infant and the ghost bell and haunted mansion. That's a pretty cool card. Very nice secret. So it looks, did they reprint all the ghost girls in Prismatic? Because now I've pulled three of them, I think. So maybe they did reprint all of them. That's interesting. So far, we haven't pulled, you know, anything too crazy. I guess the cross out and the ghost bell are best pulls so far. I mean, well, Ready Rose is decent. Just a bunch of decent stuff. We're not, we haven't pulled any of the uh, classic cards. Supposedly those are like half prints i think so i don't know exactly what that means i still need to watch house of champs video talking about it. i keep forgetting to watch it uh reinforcement of the army's troops so reinforcement of the army gets a uh a, a re a retrain i guess oh and then an ash blossom so ash blossom i've been pulling this i've been seeing a lot of people pull this so i don't know if this is short printer or if we're just getting lucky clumping is a thing when it comes to uh printing and if you don't know what that means it's basically where there's like a short printed card but you get a bunch of them like like let's say i opened one case and got like a card i'm supposed to get once like three times it's because a lot of other people got zero so it like clumps into one case a lot of the time star mine arm dragon thunder level three we've got the uh Flunderies in the scary sea the black eyes uh oh the rux and special the Riliona. that keeps happening dan mari white knight of dogmatica heritage of the light the gaia armor dragon shell and no see look there's the clumping right as we say it oh, i'm looking really smart now hey thank you thank you uh rng for making me look smart ash blossom and joy spring i don't think i just leave that last one up i'm gonna do that oh uh, this is nice though because these are really like i don't know they're just beautiful ash blossoms and ash blossom usually does well in value even when it's like uh you know a common or whatever even though there's a lot of prints coming out of it soon so i don't know if that's gonna drive it down to an actual reasonable price but it's still such a useful card i think it'll be decent so two ash i mean we cannot complain about that i've now pulled three total uh we did give away the other ones uh by the way speaking of giveaway winners make sure you guys go check out the community tab i announced them the other day i've shipped everybody's too except i think maybe one or two so we're pretty much caught up on those which feels amazing to be caught up on uh brandon reds are, is a regular rare here very interesting feels amazing to be caught up on giveaways guys it feels great because when i get behind on those that's stressful let me tell you dd is soul carrier cool the dogmatic genesis small world pretty nice secret rare there very good and then another reminder i want to remind you guys do not send anybody in the comments that says rux and telegram or any of that crap don't send them any money don't send them any info if it's a giveaway i'm going to be shipping it for free even if it costs me 20 bucks i'm going to do it because it's part of the giveaway and it just you know i don't want you guys to have to pay 80 bucks or whatever that they you know the scammers ask so that's that's not me you and i Got the Flunderies and Robina. I just wanted to remind you guys about that. Beast King Unleashed, Dogmatic of Genesis, Soul Energy Max, and Small World. Very sick. Let's see what we can get next. So this is uh, going to be our 12th pack. So a third of the way through the opening. Uh, let's see if we can get one of those uh, Blue Eyes cards. Link Apple. There it is. A classic card. Link Apple. We've got the Terrors, the Flying Red Carp, Rocket Caliber, Rux and Special. I just want to beat Rhyme Style, guys. That's all I'm saying. Trap Trick, Calaria, Abyss Keeper, the Stardust Trail, and a Ruddy Rose. Okay, another Ruddy Rose. I think this is a decent card i'm guessing it'll only be like two bucks or something like that because if it's like a 25 dollar card and then it gets printed in the tens it's usually only a couple bucks but it is in the secret slot so all the secrets are a little bit harder to get than like the ultras last year or remember when all the good cards were ultras last year so it's a little different arm dragon thunder we got ice straight tenola star mine i'm glad they made them secrets this year though i know a lot of people are mad because it's like harder to pull but this, the rarity just looks way better i think it's a, a more quality card to have if you know what i mean stellar wind wolf freya because like even if they reprint one of these cards like as like an ulti or something this is still a very quality option to have a secret rare okay supers let's go lena the light charmer the oto shidamashi and the flow under in the magnificent map this is a good reprint too because that's the regular like ultra rare out of the set was like 15 dollars so a better looking version and it is um even more accessible because the ultra rares are hard to pull out of those sets all right next pack still have not pulled a blue eyes a dark magician girl i still think is there a red eyes is it red eyes or or dark magician i can't remember i guess we'll maybe find out i just know the blue eyes and the dark magician girl because i've seen those pictures uh rux and special right I'm, i might as well just skip the rares at this point i can't see him the sous ship shari got the super rare the other one got uh 
uh, got a, just a regular common printing. Sorry, buddy. Reinforcement of the Army's troops, the Tri Brigade. And, oh my gosh, a play set of the Rocks Rose. Are you kidding me? Rocks Rose Dragon. That is, that's awesome. Okay. By also, I mean, it's not really that awesome. Let's see what else we can get. The Magic Key. Can we beat Rhyme? We have never. Ever since the beginning when we, you know, he pulled we, our first battle, I think was retro pack one. He beat me in that. He pulled a foil. I didn't pull anything. Uh, he pulled 10k dragon against me. I think he pulled a ghost rare against me. I mean, he's going to pull something good. He's going to pull with the dark magician girl, the blue eyes, something like that. Ooh, and then a DPE. That's beautiful. It's very hard to see, though, which is kind of a bummer. I think it's a little bit of a bummer on the rarity on this, but still pretty nice um, secret rare or prismatic secret, whatever they're actually called. All right, we're not even halfway, so maybe this will be kind of a long video. Maybe it'll be like over 20, so that'll be fun. I hope you guys enjoy the long video. I know you guys have seen a lot of Megatons at this point, uh, so I wanted to end it with a good one, you know, with the big giveaway and potentially pulling, because I haven't actually done the live stream yet, so I haven't actually pulled these, uh, you know, Blue Eyes and Dark Magician Girls. I'm, I figure we will pull them in the live stream but we'll see small world nice so I'm, I'm still really excited about pulling them like normally if you do it after the live when we open like a million packs it's not as fun so that's why i'm recording it ahead of time so i'm still like loving the mega tins you know by the time we do all these open and we open like six seven cases of them i'll probably be like okay yeah i'm good i'm good on mega tins so we're gonna we're gonna do this first to make it a little bit more fun supernatural danger zone psychic eraser laser i'm trying not to rux especially the rare and i didn't nice book of lunar eclipse the radiant vorescence is that how you say that the dark honest okay machina uncle sparse and a lord of the heavenly prison first one today i think we pulled a couple of those in the original video white baking very nice branded in white i didn't even know that was a card i just knew about branded in red this is not as good <laughs> oh yeah i mean i assume can we get one of those big ones come on let's go despian comedy the vanisher the b trooper squad flunderies in the scary sea black eyes we've got a rux and special we've got a flunderies and impin sunvine crossbreed soul energy max we pulled this many times alvain the essence of vanity and the greater polymerization okay i think that's gonna probably be a dud uh this was like a three dollar super rare or ultra rare i mean out of uh was it donna majesty i think so not bad there common copy you can get that a lot cheaper i'm sure let's go master's diploma basil rose shoot ultra beach Trooper, absolute hercules the gorm foul bar <laughs> you and i we got the beach trooper we got the uh, Rux and Special past the rare. Is anybody surprised? 1900, 1900, this dude is beefy. Wow, that is insane. Goki finishing move. Flutteries and Stree. Abyss Keeper. Stardust Trail. These are always together. So it's definitely, they're printed together. And we have a Small World. Is that three of those? We got a play set of Small World. Okay, that's not bad, I guess. We'll take that. Still no Blue Eyes or Dark Magician, though. We're still looking for those. So let's see what we can find. Ad libitum, going to the sewer ship, the Zexel Entrust, Arm Dragon Thunder, Magic Key Dragon, Flunderies in the Dreaming Town, Rux and Special Pass the Rare, add it again. So the Flunderies in Eglin, so all the Flunderies stuff is rares. That's interesting. Paleozoic Cambro Roaster, that's a hilarious card. Arm Sage, Nibiru, first pull of the day. All right, very good. The uh, Baby Mud Dragon and a incredible ecclesia can we get a play set that would be pretty cool it's a nice pull very very good because you can play those in threes i think i don't think that um sword soul is any good anymore or at least not currently because of uh, the current meta from what i've heard i have not played in forever guys i have not played since hardford technically in terms of meta so I'm way behind because like they didn't even have the current like top decks out yet at that point. One reason the unexplored wins. I rocks and special it again. Dan Mari is anybody surprised? Lena again. We've got the uh, Super Sight King Zero Maxwell and a Rox Rose. <laughs> okay, Rox Rose, you gotta chill out. We don't want you anymore. All right. Okay. Look, I'm sorry to say it, but I don't want you anymore. You can only put three in the deck. We've got four of you now. So I uh, hate to break it to you. You gotta stop showing up. Mega Ten time. Let's pull something. Dark Magician, Blue Eyes. Come on, Basil Rose shoot. Zexel Interest, Vanisher, Arrow Pixie. We've got the uh, Black Eyes. We got a Rux and Special added again. Binary. The Kalaria, the Biru, very nice. We've got the Baby Mud Dragon and a Drytron Mubeta Fafnir. I did not know this was in here. That's not a bad card either. I don't. Is Drytron even any good anymore? I would assume not. You know, because like it's been a while since that was like the top thing, but I don't know. Maybe, maybe it is. I don't know. We're not even at two thirds of the way. This is definitely going to be longer than I thought it was going to be. Let's go. Master Diploma, Star Mine. So hopefully they enjoy the long video. Thunder. We got to beat the uh, Psychic Eraser. We got to beat Rhyme Style. We've got it. Oh, this comes as a super. So that one doesn't get a prismatic, I guess. Uh, Shuship Shari is pretty cool. The Lina. 
the Super Sight Zero Maxwell. Oh, and a Lightning Storm. There's a good one that we have not pulled yet. Lightning Storm. Okay, I wonder how this hurt my value of my Starlight that I had in my uh, 1000 TCG player opening. You can go check out that. Check out the playlist because we have all the different videos on there from where we spent a thousand. I have a different video coming out similar to that soon. So if you guys like that one, keep an eye out. It's a uh, slightly different has to do with my top most expensive cards. All right, this is the last pack of the two thirds opening and then we are getting to the final 12 packs. Let's go Arm Dragon Thunder, Arm Dragon Blitz, B Trooper Scale Bomber, B Trooper Squad, Flunder Reason Scary Sea, Black Eyes, the Mahavilo Light of the Heavens. Oh, okay. they reprinted that. That's weird. Uh, Masquerade the Blazing Dragon. We've got the Beast King Unleashed, Gaia Armor Dragon Shell, Threshold Borg, and we have a... Okay, ZS Ascended Sage. So we're really looking for it to be a normal monster. Wouldn't we? Because if it's normal, then it could be the Blue Eyes. If it's I guess if it's an effect monster, it could be DMG because that's technically an effect monster. It has an effect. It's not a good, but it has an effect. Here we go. Come on, guys. We got the Tri Brigade Rendezvous, the Guitar Gernards. We got the Steel Star, Spendable Die, Fable Treason, Rocket Caliber. We got the Ruxin Special Classic. This was Donna Majesty 2 as well. I think it's an Ultra. Stree, Frost, Rebuild Deer. I remember that one. Branded Bond. And we have a. Why? Five copies of this in 24 packs? Like, bruh. I, I'm sure that's like a five cent card too. Here's the other Sioux ship that is a common. That's not great. Okay, 12 packs to go. What can we get out of here, guys? What can we pull? Let's go. We have a Gunkin Sioux ship, Sh Shiraru, a class carrier, Zexel Alliance, Meows Click, the Zexel Interest, Fairy Archer. We've got the Flying Red Carp, Rux and Special, Heavy Metaphors, and Mole Glam, the Crossbreed. Camber Roaster, the Zexel Construction, DD Assault Carrier, and we have a Flunderies in the Magnificent Map. Not a bad pull there, but oh my goodness, where are our pulls? You know why we're pulling not so great in terms of like the Dark Magician Girl, the Blue Eyes? Because we're in a battle. That's why. Rhyme Style is going to pull like three of each. I'm going to pull zero. It's going to be great. Thunder Dragon level five, Tenola, Star Mine, B Trooper Landing, Wolf Freyet, the Dreaming Town, Oh, Rux and Special again. Flutteries in Stree, the Pegasus Twin Saber, Linda the Light Charmer, the Oto Auto Shidamashi, and then the DV Destroyer Phoenix Enforcer. I remember how long it took us to pull that Starlight. Yeah, that one's a little bit easier to pull, at least in terms of compared to the Starlight. Come on, guys. Come on. Maybe it'll be last pack magic. Who knows? Who knows? Might be last pack magic. Let's just believe. So far, some decent pulls, I would say. We've not pulled a Prosp either. Now that I think about it, this has not been a great 10 so far. So uh, it can happen. Let's go. Here we go. Gunkinsu ship. We've got the Rux and Special Pass, the rare as always. The Stree, the Paleozoic Cambro Roaster, Dark Eye Nightmare, the Tri Brigade, and a Flunderies the Magnificent Map. That's a playset. I don't know if you play a playset in the deck, but if you do, we've got three now. So very nice. Eight packs to go. Eight packs of our what? 12 times three, 36. Eight of our 36 left. Not many. We have Zorora. Zexel Alliance, the Beast Trooper Squad, Link Apple, add it again. That's a play set of those. Supernatural Danger Zone, Psychic Eraser Laser. We've got a Rux and Special, Pass the Rare, Armed Sage, Masquerade the Blazing Dragon, Dark Ruler No More. That's a good pull. It's only our second one, the Breaking Ruin God, and a Dramaturge of Despia. Okay, that's a cool secret rare for Despia stuff. I don't know if those are good right now either, but I guess that they might be. I don't know. I don't know because of all the new stuff. How to Power of the Elements it kind of took over. We have a Parametaphals Azortless. Mighty Neptune, the Terrors of the Underroot, Meows Click, Flutteries in the Scary Sea, the Black Eyes. You literally have to like peel it off to get the rare and not Rux and Special. We got the Tao Tao, uh, Dan Mari, the White Knight of Dogmatica, the Revive Sky Dragon. We've got the Dark On, it was God, not Dragon. And then a Despian Q, Secret Rare, very nice, very cool. We're getting some Despian stuff to end it off. Okay, I'm getting a little nervous. We haven't pulled Prosperity, we haven't pulled Dark Magician Girl, we haven't pulled Blue Eyes. Uh, okay, yeah, this is not looking good, guys. This is not looking good. What can we do? Denier, still two tens to go. We gotta believe. Arm Dragon Thunder, Fable Treason. You and I, we've got the uh, secret, not a secret, the regular rare, the uh, Impen, we've got the Breaking Ruin God, the Stardust Synchron, and a, oh, Rubeta Fafnir. I was like, oh, well, what XCs is in here? I can't remember. So not that, not that great. Last time it was Zeus. Now we have Rubeta Fafnir as our XCs. Uh, he's, he's holding it down for the XCs cards, you know, because he's the only one. Masters Diploman, Freeze Bell. Metaphors Vanisher, come on. We're not beating Rhyme Style if we don't pull one of these three. We're gonna be in big trouble. So we gotta pull something good. Uh, another Ruxin Special. We got the Sunvine Crossbreed, Frost, 
Alvain, the Essence of Vanity, and a Dark on Nightmare, and a Ghost Bell and Haunted Mansion. A pretty good card. We'll take that. But um, I don't think Ghost Bells are going to win us this battle. I could be wrong. Four packs to go. Can we do it? Can we pull it off? Last second pull. We're going to need something big, I think. These uh, packs are going everywhere over here. So Aurora, Ice Shade Acti, the Beat Trooper Scale Bomber, Flip Frozen. Chronomaly Magellic Globe, we got a Ruxin Special Monster Assortment, Blazing Dragon, Ruin Force, Contract with the Abyss, only the first pull of that, very weird how the Ultras are working out, oh, another Dark Ruler No More, that's our third one, and I forgot this was in here, Forbidden Droplet, oh yes, now that's a big pull, Forbidden Droplet is probably going to be pretty nice as a Seeker Rare, I think it's now it's like a fourth print now overall, it's got an ulti, it's got a regular secret, it's got a another secret and now it has a prismatic seat wow they really like high rarity droplets so that's a really good pull that'll definitely help the battle droplet is one that it's been reprinted so much recently it's just i've just like written it off like i just forgot about it like every single time i forget droplets in here but it's still going to be definitely a value card very nice cordius the Enbanamide, we got the Sea God, we got the uh, Dragonic, we got the Magical Cylinders classic card with the Magic Cylinders, Trap Trick of Vesiculo, the Oto Shidamashi, and then the Arm Dragon Thunder level 10, and a Small World, the fourth copy of that. Okay, We're, there's a lot of good spells in here though, like a ton of good spells, two packs to go. Hope you guys have enjoyed this somewhat of a long video. It might be around 20 minutes at this point, so it's probably gonna be over 20 minutes. Let's see if we can pull something big to end it. Come on, let's go. Meow's click, let's do it. Sushi Ship Uni, the Eraser Laser. We got a Ruxin Special. We've got the Goki Finishing Move. Lightswing, Lilla Treat, the Danger Disturbance Disorder. Threshold Borg. And we have a Credible Ecclesia. There's our playset. We can't complain about that, I guess. Pretty nice. So it seems like a lot of the secrets are really good. There's not a lot of duds. Last year, almost all the secrets were duds. It was weird. Final pack of the opening versus Rhyme. Come on, send us the luck in the comments, guys. We got to beat Rhyme Style. Make sure to go check out his video after this. Uh, I'll have the link in the description. This is going to be a fun battle. I think we've done okay, but we need a big pull here to really feel good about it. Danger Zone. There's the rare. We got the Flunderies and Snow. I can tell because it's trying to like be pulled up for Ruxin Special. Moonlit Chill. Nice. The Beast King Unleashed. Apex Predation. Dogmatic and Genesis. And our final card is... There is not a more poetic ending to this video than a Rocks Rose for the sixth time. So one out of every six packs had a Rocks Rose in it. That's really exciting. All right, that was a weird opening. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to subscribe to the channel for more epic content and go check out Rhyme Style's video. And don't forget to enter the giveaway for two cases of these Mega Tens, uh, one for two different winners from Sassy Auto. Make sure to follow him on Instagram to enter that giveaway as well. Shout out to Choice333, Nightshade Gaming YT, Hayden Jameson, Squirtle, Hoppus, Flexi Boy, Dizzy, Ernesto Deanda, Puffins of Doom, TCG Trusted Cards, JT Cho, Tomato Juice, Daxter, Tone Fo Show, Anana Tai Show, Christopher Ward, Ian Musa, John Nolan, Junior Barding, Mike Nance, Mimic Gecko, Seth Fisher, Stanley, Thomas McLean, and Tone Z. Thank you guys for supporting the channel, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.